yeah, that's right. Fuck the war. Hey, what's up, guys? It's MC Cat here, and today I am going to be playing this war of mine. If you can't see by that awesome title there, never played it before. Don't really know much about it. I bought it on the July 4th sale, and um, I don't know what took me so long to play it, but now I'm gonna play it. So let's get down to it. Playing it on the remote again. This way, you guys can hear my voice as I did with Bioshock. I can't seem to get up to the survive button there, though. Can I just... Okay, what, can I just press start? Get up there! How do I get up there? What a fail. Those are credits. Oh, let's go to the settings first. Um, turn the music volume down. don't want any copyrights. Um... Okay, I'm gonna put it on, I'm gonna leave it on high for now, but, like, there's no doubt that we're gonna have some problems, because my GPU is just absolute crap. Dude, I wanna play. I can't, it's not letting me get up to, to, to play. Like, where's, where's the start? That, that's definitely exit. What the shit? What? How did that happen? Okay, okay, it just started. Alright, so, let's play this game. I don't know exactly what it's about. I read a little bit of the plot. Uh, apparently, it's like the perspective of a war from, like, a refugee's eyes, rather than a soldier's, which is what's the perspective in most games about war. It's, it's the soldier's perspective. But this time, it's going to be the refugees. Okay, so, there's my house, it looks like. It's, uh... I can't tell if it's, like, fucked up, or if that's just how we're seeing it. Like, I don't know if, if, like, some missile just, like, cleaved the entire right side wall of my house. Or if this is just how it looks. Okay. Alright, guys, sitting down in the chair. Okay, what's, uh, what's happening? What do I do? What do I do? Something's going down in the kitchen. Okay, uh, when the Civil War broke out, many people thought it would only last a couple of weeks. It's been years since government military surrounded the rebels in the capital, cutting off all supply lines. Okay. The civilian population trapped in the city are suffering from hunger, disease, and shelling. I'm missing bombshells. Katya met both Pavel and Bruno. Pavel? Pavle? Pavel? Before the war. She used to be a reporter while Bruno had his own television cooking show. Pavel, I'm just going to call him P, P, P Tower, Pavel, fine, Pavel, was the star of the local football team. Katya even interviewed him once. Now they met in dramatically different circumstances, looking for food and shelter. Wow, damn. Okay, so these people were like, st I don't know what timeline this is, by the way. I don't know what war this is. It might not even be like an actual thing that's happened in the past. It could just be fantasy, but, um, wow, so these people were, uh, they were like people well off. Oh, whoa, what was that? Uh, okay, that was a triangle. Um, this looks like our mission. So toss, we have only one chair. We lack beds, and we have to sleep on the floor. It's hard to get a good night's sleep on a heart. Okay, yeah, we'll do many distressing. Oh shit, that sucks. We don't have radio. Okay, so they don't know what's going on. This book's. Uh, we lack coffee and cigarettes. I like how that's like its own thing, like the most important thing. <laughs> out of the war. We have breaches in the walls. Our shelter is not safe. Damn, dude. Okay, so who am I? Oh, am I that guy there? Oh, I am. I'm the one that was sitting on the chair. Okay. Oh, wow. Oh, I'm Katya. Okay, I'm Katya. Uh, can I... Ooh, ooh. Let's see. Katya. Okay. Grew up in the city, but went to study and started working as a... Okay, yeah, um... I picked to write reports on it. It's here, but anyway. Just to check on my parents. Alright. It was too late. I found my house in ruins. My family had despaired. I've been looking for them ever since. Damn, dude, that's... Alright, you're going back up the stairs. Did she... Did her picture just blink down there? Oh, man, that's scary. Did it really? Or am I like... Like, is my mind just fucking with me? I'm staring at her picture down in the right cor right bottom. It did blink. Whoo, okay. All right. That that kind of kind of shook me a little bit. 
Okay, I heard some bombs. Okay, so I don't want to go outside. Let's talk to Pavel and whatever. I don't really know. Wow. Curved right off the bat. Okay. Must be because I'm a woman, right? I guess we don't have gender equality here. That's fucked up. Fuck you guys, too. Um, it doesn't seem like there's a tutorial or anything as to how I interact with things. It seems to just open a door. I just run into them. How do I go up the stairs? Go, go up the stairs, Katya. What did she say? We're lucky it's something. Katya, go, go up the stairs. No, no, no. I... What? What? What the fuck? End it. The... End the day. That must be how to exit. Okay. Oh. Alright, so that's how I go up the stairs. How do I... I'm guessing A interacts with that? What is that? What'd you find in there, Katya? What'd you find in there? Anything good? Components. Various components needed to make just about anything. Nails, duct tape, plastic containers. Okay. Uh... What? Just... Oh, X gravel. Yeah. Okay. So I, ha I had some sugar cubes and stuff. So I guess this isn't our house. We're just camping out in here for now. And right now, I'm rummaging for things to survive. This is terrible. Let's grab all. I don't know what I grabbed, but I grabbed it. seems there's a lot of stuff. Simple barricade, I can dismantle in a minute. I don't know if we want to dismantle a barricade, though. Okay, yes, it looks like everyone is taking shelter in the basement floor. That looks like the basement floor. Herbs. Okay, med so medication. Parts. Sugar. Essential ferment. Okay, fermentation. So it seems this is like a survival game. Okay, I didn't know... I didn't know this was like a survival game. Um, hope we do survive, of course. Okay, uh, get back down the stairs. Get down the stairs. Katya, get down the stairs. Okay. Nice. Let's talk... I don't feel so well. I think I have shivers. Oh, shit. Oh, I'm slightly sick. That's... Oh, damn it. What, so what do I do? What do I do? Raw foods edible would be nutritious when cooked. Herbal medications and roll up cigarettes. Okay. Um, doesn't look like I can equip or use in any matter. I think I'd have to cook it. Let's talk to... Talk to Pavel. What? No, I didn't... I didn't want to close the dot. Talk... Is this Pavel? Talk, talk, talk to Pavel. Alright, fuck you too then. Um, okay, looks like there's something here. That's the fridge. I'm eating. I'm eating like our last piece of food, aren't I? Yeah, I am. I didn't even ask Pavel or whatever. What? With proper tools, we could build the stuff we need. Not very filling, but it's food. I'm slightly sick. How do I fix myself when I'm slightly sick? What's this? Yeah, let's go through that. No, no, go through go through the garbage. Maybe we can find some medicine. It's taking so long without Oh, I'm digging! Oh, yeah, no, don't do that. What the hell? You're gonna hurt your hands. <laughs> I was like, why's it taking so long? Um looks like we can do something downstairs. Let's check out downstairs. Upstairs just looks like more stuff we can rummage through. Oh, there's more downstairs. Okay, what is this? What should I make? Oh, so I could... Components we need. Alright, yeah, let's make a bed for us. So it looks like I'm just trying to survive in the house. Essentially. Metal workshop. Ooh, okay, so what's more important to make? A crude stove. That seems better. Drag to place an empty destination. Yeah, let's put the stove in the kitchen. I feel that's better. We can cook food for ourselves. There's a better chance of survival there. It's taking a while. How do I... Oh, there we go. Okay, nice. So I can make... Bruno's a good cook, so I can make uh, multiple people do stuff at one time. Okay, that's good. That's good. 
Let's get things. Go, up, go upstairs, Bruno. Um, Bruno, we're gonna go through that garbage over. No, we can't. There's a barricade. All right, Bruno, go up. Go up this ladder. Uh, there's more barricades everywhere else. I need something. The door is locked. Okay. Well, go through this, Bruno. I could try to move the rubble. Okay, that will clearly... Oh, no. That will clearly take a while. So let's go to Pavel. And we're going to have him help Bruno up there. Because it looks like there's something in those cupboards up there that we can... That, like, we would really need. Go help. Go help. Go help Bruno, Pavel. Pavel, come on. We can't make Katya do it, okay? She's the woman. Alright. She's going to have a tough time. As two strong, healthy gentlemen that are not slightly sick, you guys should really... Why aren't you doing anything? Can two people not work on it? We can try to move the rubble. Yeah, move it. I guess two people can't work on it. Okay. Alright, so we'll just... Damn it, Pavel. I don't... You, you let me down. You let Katya down. She's sick and everything. You know what? That was actually a cool way to slide down a ladder. I have regained respect for you. Um, we're going to go back to where Katya was digging before. And we're going to dig this out. Yeah, just finish that for Katya. And let's go back to Katya. Alright, and we're going to cook some... Katya's going to cook some food for the men, for everyone. We're going to have some nice cooked food. What is this? What is this? Fuel. Oh, I don't have fuel. Shit. Everything that we can burn in the unit of warm bar, please, or in the stove to cook food, we can make it from wood books or components. Okay. Man. Um. Alright, we're gonna make three. Actually, just two. I don't think we can make two, actually. Shit, Katya, we gotta go. What was that sound? Katya, let's go. We gotta go look for some the fuck I'm hearing like fucking like monkeys and shit from the Wizard of Oz what the hell is that Katya let's see what else we can make here let's see what else we can craft here while the guys are digging um, <clears throat> I don't want to like is that important the chair it's better to send a chair than on the floor we should build it to make this place more like home it will make us feel better in these tough times so it'll make us feel better right but it's not essentially as useful as like a bed, which it looks like I can make. So let's make a bed. Can I not make a bed? It's 4.20 p.m. It's 17 degrees Celsius. That's cold, I, I think. Can I not make a bed? I guess we can't make a bed. Okay, uh, what's... Okay, so I'm just guessing that that, that just means house upgrades. So we're gonna go here. Alright, so now you're... Well, see, I don't want Katya to, like, get fucked up. Alright, let's... Alright, yeah, dismantle that barricade, Bruno. <laughs> yeah, come on! Oh, yank that shit. You're a big man. You got a nice big mustache-beard combo. Don't let me down. Why did Katya get sick? Out of everyone else, Katya got sick. She has good bargaining skills. What I find... Alright, I found drugs. Let's just grab all. I found jewelry, it looks like. Okay, wood for fire. Valuable bargaining item. Okay. Alright, um... Let's go back to Bruno. We need Bruno to do some stuff. That's locked. I can't get through it. Um, there's that barricade down there. Can you dismantle that, Bruno? Some loose planks, I could easily remove them. Remove them. There we go. Alright, you're done. What's out here? See, I don't know if I should have removed the barricade. What if soldiers come and, like, kill us? <laughs> mm -hmm. 
Yes, I got food. Nice. Everyone's eating today. Uh, Pavel's a really fast runner. It says that. And I, like, I can see the difference. I can barely get up this ladder here. Go up there. While you're going up there, we're gonna... Why did you stop? Why did you stop, Katya? Who said you could stop? You gotta pull your own weight. Alright? I know you're sick, but... Prop tools to build the stuff we need. Look through that, Bruno. Okay. Oh, this is weird. I mean, like, not, not weird as a bad thing, like a hard thing, because... I'm multitasking as three people. Okay. Uh, what'd you find? Just take take it all. Take no, Katya, keep keep doing your thing, Katya. Alright, uh Bruno, look through this. No, no, you already looked through that, dude. Oh, it's nighttime? Shit, what does that mean? Oh, now we have to go What? Okay, Bruno scavenging. What am I, I don't understand. Disney movie recently got shelled and many houses are still burning. People are fleeing for their lives in a hurry, so we may have some useful stuff here there without meeting anyone. Okay, um, so let's just go to... Katya needs sleep because she's sick. Um, Pavel will be on guard, and Bruno will scavenge. So that's where we live. Yeah, let's go look at the shelled cottage. Huge amounts of food, lots of meds, some food, huge amounts of meds. Alright, let's just go there. And how do we start that now? X. Okay. Is it X? Oh, I have to give him necessary stuff to do so? What the fuck? Our things will use the equipment during attack. What the fuck? Dude, I don't know what to give him. <laughs> I, I don't know what to give him. Um, I guess just just scavenge, Bruno. Just go ahead and look around, dude. Don't die on me. Oh, if we lose... If, like, I lost Bruno on the first day. The house is still burning. Is it safe to go inside? Oh, shit. I, like, I have to do it myself. What's this? That's the exit. We don't want to do that. Come on, Bruno. Let's go gather some stuff, Bruno. Get that rat! Get that rat! It's good dinner! Dude, take all... can't grab all. Oh, what's a teddy bear? I'm taking that teddy bear, dude. Or we need, yeah, we need, um, we definitely need wood. We're, not, we're definitely gonna need these materials here. Alright, and now my backpack is full. See, I don't feel like we have enough wood, so I'm gonna get rid of that. Nope. Look through that again, Bruno. Uh, how do I remove the wood? A is drop. Yes, and then let's take the wood. There we go. Now I'm full. Oh. Okay, look, when I take a big step, it makes sound and I'll get noticed. So let's just creepily walk back. We got wood and we got materials. That's good enough for me. Bruno came back. Good job, Bruno. Good scavenge, pal. Good scavenge. <laughs> now we have a lot of wood, which means we can cook food. We can... What's happening? I'm just, I'm like just waiting to hear like a gunshot and like everyone is dead and I'm just gonna fail. Like that would suck. A lot. There you go, Bruno. So, I found plenty of really fine stuff. What a night. Alright, Bruno is definitely tired. So now... Yeah, I know what he did. I was there. Bruno, um, have a seat, Bruno. Just have a seat. Oh, shit. He's hungry and he's tired, so we're going to give him a break. Slept poorly, slightly sick still. Okay. Katya, let's get some food made. No, actually, Bruno needs to make the food. Pavel... I don't think Pavel finished looking through that stuff in the, in the house, did he? Wait, can we, like, research this? Like, will there be new stuff here? It looks like there could... There is! Huh! Hell yeah, I'm grabbing all that. 
Okay, so stuff respawns. That's good. That's good to know. Somehow someone just decided to dump stuff back there. Alright, look through here, Pavel. We're gonna take it all. Now we need to... Pavel is hungry and tired. Yes. Katya's the only one that slept. So, um, okay, Bruno's hungry, so Bruno can eat the food in there. I haven't slept in some time. Actually, alright, fine, Bruno, you can cook, I guess. Fuck, whatever, what do I know? No, okay, we're missing, we're missing, like, fuel. We're missing fuel. How are we missing fuel? So one meat just spawns in the fridge by itself, just one meat, that's it, okay. Um go to Katya. Oh shit, there's someone out there. Open up, I brought something to barter. 